That's a face. Mr. Diaz. Talk about uh, recycling character models. The truth that you killed our comrades overground and released that monster from the cell? How could someone like you do that? What do you mean someone like me? Unbelievable. An arrest warrant has been issued for you. Your being an executive will not affect how I act upon you. I ask for no resistance whatsoever. <laughs> Pretty much how you feel at every meeting at work. This is how we do our meetings here in the underground facility. So, now these guys are a little... In the beginning, they're a little tougher because they're a little quicker. Bitch. Back up. Miss nice, bitch. Yeah. Oh. You got these grappling moves, you got kicking and punching, it's fantastic. Nice. Sorry, rookie. Oh, I didn't even drop anything. Old jerk. Get in that door. Just picking up some items here before I progress on. You don't actually have to come down to this uh, level. But I want the extra shit. Oh shit. Excuse me. Oh, jumped right into that one. Motherfucker. Man, I hate those things. And they take their security very serious here. Hmm. I seem to have missed a panel. Alright, let's get up here so I can survey without getting shot. Without getting blown up. Need to be up there. Alright. I think I actually need to go around the other side of the hallway. Unless it's over here. Nope, it's not. Alright, we just went the wrong way. Which is fine. I think there's like an enemy coming up anyway that hits kind of hard, so... I'd rather I'd rather heal. <laughs> yeah, it's a nice thing about save points. I always loved games that did this. At save points, they just restore your health. Always... Always appreciated games that did that. Oh, there we go. Oh, that running is going to be a pain later. <laughs> yeah, stay away. Aiming on this gun leaves something to be desired. I'll just come up here. There is the red panel. Alright. I don't think there's really anything other on that way. Alright, we're cool. Ooh. You see that dodge chat? Oh, that was some real shit. Alright. My health items. This is another one of those games. Kind of like, you know, like Skyrim or something like that, where you just kind of like hoard all your health items and at the end you have a shit ton. So barring anything bad happening. 
I'm gonna go in here first. Barring anything bad happening, I should have I should end the game with like a ton of health items. You can also farm them from these uh skirt wearing aliens. These guys hit hard though, so. But every time you knock them down, they do drop a health item. So that's pretty helpful. Oops, didn't mean to do right. Ooh, he dodged me. That asshole. Knock down. Just crap on an item for me. There we go. Okay. Didn't even get hit. Let's see. Are those the rockets of cameras? <laughs> yeah. Pretty much. So there are like some like those cameras do shoot lasers at you, but there are some cameras later that will drop bombs on you from above. So that's just kind of why I shoot them before I even jump up on levels. Just because number one, they can hit you with a laser and knock you right back off the level. But later ones can actually drop bombs on you, so... So there's that. And again, not very obvious uh, panels you can panels you can grab onto. So, you know, common game flaws, but it's okay. Stop that. There we go. <laughs> a little bit precarious, but we're fine. And here we go. Alright. This is kind of like a side room. Gotta take out some of like these those little glowing boxes on the wall that I shoot. Those open up laser grids in different parts of the level, so pretty much have to seek them out a couple times. Ooh, offense enhancer. Those will definitely be good. The game's kind of neat. You get a mixture of like health items, but there's also like kind of guns that are only usable in combat. The gun I have only works on like um, kind of like robots or the little security systems. It's like a diffuser gun, diffuser pistol or whatever you want to call it. But there are guns you can get that are purely just for combat. They can only be used in combat as well as enhancing items, so during the games you can get items that raise and lower, that raise your defense, raise your speed and attack, but can also lower your enemy's attack and speed. Okay. Let's see if I can get this item here, chat. Not necessarily necessary, but... Ooh, got it. Nice. Good job, self. Because those offense razors are going to be extremely helpful. Because you get these items that are like offense enhancers. And they only like raise your offense for a limited amount of time in battle. Whereas these razors, offense razors and defense razors, can be used outside of battle. And they give you a permanent increase to your offense and defense. And I think there's one for speed, too. Alright. I think this is the right way. Nope, wrong way.
Oh, actually, this was the right way to go. Alright, bear with me, chat. <laughs> Forgive my ignorance, I only play this game once a year. There we go. Wait. I think I went through this way. Yep, I'm stupid. Never mind. Jesus. Ugh. It's early, chat. Alright, it's early. <laughs> Alright. Now we're going the right way. Oh, bitch. Damn. Rude. Alright. <laughs> right on that one. Ooh, flame shot. Damn it. Getting wrecked here. Yeesh. Let's see. Oh, there he is. I see him. So how, how hybrid is this heaven? Like, like cats and dogs living together? Like a centaur? Hmm. Both, actually. So these enemies I'm fighting now are basically like biological weapons that were created um, by the hybrids, really. So the hybrids, we'll run into them later. Ah, shit. Wasn't fast enough. I got a defense booster on that one. Yeah. Basically, the hybrids we'll run into them later are basically... Um... I guess, at least in their in their opinion, physically superior beings. So they're basically humanoid beings, but they've been kind of like humans that have been perfected, for lack of a better term, be like, I don't know, better physically, better mentally, just kind of all around better beings. And basically their goal is to take over kind of like Earth, just kind of go, on, go above ground. Uh... Yeah, they've been kind of like created to go above ground and replace some humans that are already there. Basically kind of like clones, but superior clones, at least in physical prowess and things like that. Their third main goal is to go above ground, kind of replace the originals, and then slowly <clears throat> get them into positions of power to take over the leaders of the world, starting with the U.S. Yeah, and so basically they're going to create a hybrid heaven above ground. Because right now we're underground New York right now. So yeah, keep that in mind for the end of the game. We are underground New York. There we go. Items for days. So yeah, so the title comes into the fact that they're trying to get above ground, replace all the regular humans with hybrids, and so thereby creating a superior, superior race of creatures on above ground. Is that the boss? I don't know if that's the boss. Oh shit, it's you. Ah, uh, dope. Hashtag Trump's America. You know, right? It's... Actually, the way this year has gone, this game's not a bad metaphor for where we're at. <laughs> Ooh, barely clipped him. Barely clipped him. And also, it's kind of cool, well, I mean, the, some of the enemies do heal. It's kind of cool they put it away, so, like, depending on also, like, where you hit the enemies, it can cause more damage. So, like, if an enemy is, like, trying to walk to you and kind of, like, shuffles past you, and you get the chance, and you can, like, say, like, say if they shuffle past you and you have a chance 